this is Kirby. Kirby Dreamland. The game that you guys chose for me to do is my next Let's Play of PK. Turtle Kermit. Or whatever. Whatever you guys call me. PK, Turtle Kermit. P to the K. A to the J. P to the Y. Z to the Y. Ah, whatever. Yep, this is Kirby Dreamland 1. And sorry if this is in Japanese, but the original version in American is uh, slated for non-release as a ROM because they're jerks. And anyway, I couldn't find it. If you guys could, send me it, and maybe I'll rethink about doing it. But the game is pretty much the same with the text and everything because the stages are still caught the same. So let's get started so I can give you guys examples of what Kirby is and what he's about. And our first stage is Green Greens. Nice and clean. Nice and green. And let's go. Kirby sucks. I mean, I'm serious. He sucks. As you can see, we are sucking up enemies. If you guys have played Super Smash Brothers, you guys would know what Kirby is. And I just got hit because I blinked. But we have health in him. And Kirby is a pink blob, but in this version, he's white. I mean, the reason why he's white is because this is only a black and white number one. But they originally wanted him to be white. If you've seen the game cover, it'd be... He'd be white. And we're riding on the Warp Star, which is his teleportation device. I don't know where they got the idea from. Yep. Kirby can only fight by sucking up enemies. But if you guys know more about Kirby, he normally takes people's abilities. He just kicked me. Anyway, um, in this game, since this is his first adventure, um, no, no, none of the people thought about uh, what he should do. So they just like this made this a child's game, and they did all the simplest crap as possible. Originally, when they were developing this game, it was supposed to be just a blob named Popo, -po. but then they just decided, hey, why don't we just give him some feet and some eyes and just keep it simple like that? Give him the power to suck. Okay, and that's how Kirby was created. Thank you, Hal's Laboratory, for one of the greatest video game characters of all time to me. I don't know about you guys. I personally think he's cool. There's nothing wrong with a little blob of pink things sucking everything up. Nobody knows if this is a girl or a boy, but I think it's safe to assume that he's a boy. Since, like, he'd be looking boyish half the time. And I'm starting Dreamland 1 because... Uh, because I like this game. From Dreamland 1, I'm going to do the next Dreamland right after it. And this is like one of the first few times I'm playing the game, so you guys shouldn't really get on me if I don't really talk about it this much. But I know, uh, I played it as much to know this. In every Kirby game, the first boss is always this guy, Wispy Woods. And all we got to do is suck up apples and spit them out at him. You, you suck in your face. And currently, I'm recording from the camera as I play the game, because I'm doing a platformer. Ouch! Damn it. Anyway, I'm finna win. A little jerk, spitting apples at me. A little puff balls and crap. Only I can do that. Yeah. Yeah, who sucks? Huh? In your face. In your mouth. In your nose. Yeah. In your eye. Yeah, yeah, I'm done. Okay. Best dance crew, the Kirby's. Oh! Hey! Oh! Yes! And that's how we get it started. The next area here is Castle of Lolo. This game is really quick because it was meant for children. For like five year olds and stuff. And you can beat this game on a road trip! And I just got hit. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. And that ability will always remain an ability for Kirby. Except in Dreamland games. After this one. Anyway, that was called the mic power. And that was the bomb power, which I wasted. Crap. And now I'm in some place that I don't even know, and I'm getting hit. Crap. I'm going down. And these masks come to life, apparently. I'm gonna go through here. Oh, crap. And there's fish. Underwater, I guess. Like, you only can. You can't even attack underwater. What the heck? And you just walk. If I spit underwater, it just flops out of my wild mouth. So they kind of kept that simple. And I'm just going to keep getting hit, man. I'm scared. Ah, there we go. 
Walk, Kirby, walk. I've seen a person walk underwater before. That was pretty cool. Ooh! This lollipop here? This thing will give us invincibility. This has been slated in Kirby, too. I mean, Kirby the series. And all you gotta do is run, but since I can't run through enemies, because all you can do is walk on here, we're just gonna get on a warp star and fly away. The castle of Lolo. And there's Lolo right now. Ouch! Punk! In your face! I'm sorry. If you guys seen the series, Kirby right back at you on Fox Boxer, 4 Kids TV. Yeah, the slogan was right back at you because he, like, spits things out right back at you. Or he'd steal the powers that the enemy has. Or... Yeah, if you guys don't know this much about Kirby, don't re freaking watch this. You know what? No, watch it. Because I don't really know that much about this game. And I would really love to have a new emulator right now. And I'm gonna get hit. Safe! Ouch! God damn it! That ain't funny! Alright, I think I'm safe. There we go. In your face. Ooh, we just dodged a ghost. Boss time! Now we gotta fight Lolo and Lolo. Quick info about Lolo. Uh, he was um, a character by Hal's Laboratory also in um, the adventure game for NES called The Adventures of Lolo. I don't know why they made him a boss on here. But I guess because like they got his character slate or whatever. But it was all like, hey, why don't we just put him as a boss as Kirby? We're feeling lazy. And this is a kid's game, they won't know. And La 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 is the opposite of La La La, just with a. Oh crap, I just cornered myself. Don't do that. She's the opposite of La La La, because her name is La La La. In Mexico, the A's and the O's differentiate from girls and boys. Best dance crew, Kirby's! Look at him dance. I don't know why they just like, how they animated all this, but. It's pretty easy with sprites. And I'm probably gonna be beating this game in a few videos, in just like less than three. Hopefully. I think I'm just gonna record them all tonight, and then I'll just update them on like different times. Yep, I can't ramble. Oh crap. I can't ramble about anything I want anymore, because I'm playing the game, and like as I play, I got really not much to talk about other than school, but I don't really wanna get personal in my life on Let's Play. Because I think I could have had a lot more subscribers than 75 for Let's Play Final Fantasy Tactic Event. <laughs> so please don't hate me. Does that make me a bad Let's Player if I don't just talk about myself? Saffron doesn't do it. Hmm. But currently, he's just doing random Let's Plays now. He did a Let's Play of Star Fox. Oh, ooh, dodge that. He did a Let's Play of Star Fox. He did a Let's Play of... Well, they're more like Let's Tries, and I keep getting hit, of games that he doesn't even play. Normally, he just used to play Banjo-Kazooie, which is why I like him. Oh, well, that's your life. Oh, don't touch the bottom of this. I know that for sure that I would die, because that's the only obstacle in this room. And these guys are named Kabu, and they appear at times, and oh crap. I'm lucky. And these spike things around will take one damage if you get hit by them. I can't suck this up, so. Haha. <laughs> right back at you. That's lame. Whoever thought of that idea was probably four kids. The people who ruined one piece of shaman. King! No! God darn. Mm. Oh, I thought I'd have to start all the way at the beginning of the level. And my first death. Hey, don't get mad at me. If I die on this game, okay? This is my first time playing, and this isn't like any other Kirby game, because this is the beginning. All the first Nintendo games are super hard. Like, say, uh, Super Mario. Uh, Super Mario, period. I mean, oh. Anyway, yep. That was the spicy curry. If you played Super Smash Bros. Brawl, you would see it, and you shoot fireballs out of your mouth. Obviously. And you go a lot faster, too, but you lose it whenever you enter in the water. Sorry if I didn't describe it, but like I said, this game is super hard. And we're going on a whale. Ooh, a cutscene. Ah, oh, man, I gotta make this quick. I have a deja vu feeling. Like I felt this somewhere. Oh, well, anyway. The mint gives you the power to breathe. 
Oh crap, we're fighting a blimp. I don't remember what's his name, but yeah, that the thing we just ate was a mint. We got the power to be breathe puffballs that can kill this thing. It's probably one of the most interesting boss battles in Kirby's history. Cause you never get to do this in any other game. And I'm gonna die. But not before he does! Dance crew! And now I'm gonna cut this. So, here's Kirby. Starting from Dreamland 1, going all the way to, to the next one. So, next time, bubbly clouds. <coughs> Subscribe to me, write to me, thank you, and good night.